Hello, it's Dahlia here from Britsent. Today we're going to look at some very similar sounding consonant sounds at the end of words. For example, bag and back. So it's the g and the k sound. We've decided to do this topic because many of my Korean students tell me that when these words are written phonetically in Korean, they look the same. So our two words, back and bag, sound very similar. However, the meanings of the words are completely different. So we'll look at them separately and then we'll look at them together. So let's go. Firstly, let's look at the k consonant sound. To make this sound, the back of your tongue needs to stop the airflow. And when you release the air, it makes this sound. K. And remember that this sound is unvoiced. But remember not to emphasize it too much. It's a very light sound. So for back, we wouldn't say back. We'd say back. Back. I've got your back. Dock. He's standing on the dock. Lock. Did you change your lock? Okay, so now let's look at the g ending sound. Now with this sound, your mouth is in exactly the same shape as when you say the k ending sound. However, this time it is voiced. One way to know whether you're making a voiced sound or not is to put your fingers on your throat and if you feel a vibration, then you know that it is a voiced sound. Bag. I've bought a new bag. Dog. She's always wanted a dog. Log. He's sleeping like a log. So, as you can see, these consonant sounds, g and k, they sound very similar. However, try not to emphasize them too much because this can lead to a very common mistake that I hear a lot. And this is adding an extra syllable at the end of the word. So for example, some students, instead of saying back, they tend to say back. Or with the word dog, they will say dog. So even though this might feel natural to you, it's not good to develop these bad pronunciation habits. However, one way to stop this, if the word is a monosyllabic word, that is a word with one syllable, you can really try to emphasize the first letter of the word. For example, with the word back, you can really emphasize the letter B. So you can say back. Now this should take the emphasis off the end of the word and it should stop you from adding an extra syllable. So, as I mentioned, when these sounds come at the end of the words, you only need to pronounce them very slightly. Now, listen to these sentences and see if you can A. Hear the difference between the sounds and B. Repeat after me. There is a bag on my back. Which pig did you pick? The duck dug a hole. That's all from me today. Remember, if you want to improve your English to be ready for any situation, sign up to Britsent. We offer one-to-one -one classes, both online and face-to-face. -face. We also offer translation services from Korean to English and high-quality editing services. Check out the website for more details. Thanks for watching and see you later.